but I have just a thing full of love snow! Princess Toy Review Hi Prince and Princess, Princess Fam! Hi Prince and Princesses, it's Princess Granny! Today we're going to be doing the Snow Fluff Science Experiment! Okay, so let's check out everything we need for our science experiment. So we're going to need a bowl, a measuring cup, we're going to need some shaving cream, some cornstarch, and some food color. How do we start? Well, we're going to start by measuring out one cup of cornstarch. Would you like to do it? Okay. One cup of cornstarch, she said. Ah. Ooh. We need to open this and ask an adult to help you. And then we gotta put one cup right in here. And now I'm gonna add one cup of cornstarch because I wanna make my own snow oh, enough too. Whoa, okay, awesome. And now? And now we measure up one cup of this shaving cream. Oh. Okay, let's put it in. Whoa, it looks like snow already. Yeah, I think that's about a cup. And I'm gonna use my spoon to put it in. And now it's my turn. Here it goes. Whoa, Granny, you're really good at it. I know. Look, whoa. whoa. And now I put it in too. And the next step is we get to stir it. You do, but you could also add food coloring if you want to make it colorful. But remember, Granny, what we're gonna make? Snow? Snow, but who is made of snow? Santa? No! no. It. Olaf! Yes, we're gonna make Olaf, so we're actually gonna keep our snow fluff white. But if you yes. wanna make it any other color, now's the time to add it. So, what we're gonna do now is we're gonna use our spoon to mix the two together, and we're gonna mix until it looks like grated cheese. How are you doing, Granny? I'm doing good. I'm doing Whoa. mix it, mix it, mix it. I think yours is it, definitely it, at the grated it, cheese part. Mix it part. till it's done. Mm. Okay, so I now, so too. when you're at this point, you wanna use your hands to mix it together. Okay, so our hands are gonna give it some moisture and hopefully get it to stick together more, but let's see, okay. Whoa, I am making such a huge mess, but this is so much fun because it's so soft and it's so fluffy. I'm making a snowball. You got a snowball, Look at my snowball. But wait, let me see, let me test it. Oh, that's actually really good. Isn't it? It's like a real snowball. Pow! Yay! I think mine is a little bit too powdery, so it's not really sticking too well. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add more shaving cream to give it the texture that I want. Whoa, awesome. Okay, I'm just gonna add a little bit and then I'm going to mix some more. Hmm, awesome. I think I'm getting one snowball here. Me too. I'm getting a really nice one. Mm -hmm. But Princess Fam, how come these two ingredients make like snow fluff? Well, it's actually quite simple. What yeah. happens is basically the shaving cream has lots of little bubbles. And because of those little bubbles, the cornstarch will float to the surface. And that's how it turns from nothing to snow. <laughs> Okay, so me and Granny are all done making our three snowballs because Olaf has a head, a body, and a lower body, I guess. Yes! Okay, so I say we start on his face first. What do you think? Okay. Yes, let's make his face. Okay, so we actually got some M&Ms and some gumdrops because we're gonna use those to make Olaf's eyes and Olaf's nose. You want blue for his eyes? Sure. <gasps> You're gonna give him blue eyes like Granny? Mm -hmm. oh. okay. okay, so I'm just gonna add one here and another one right here. And now we need his nose and we have some gumdrops. <gasps> oh, and I think his nose is orange, but I'm gonna take a red for Granny. Okay, let's put his orange nose right here. And next, we need Olaf's 
three here. And I have just a thing. Where is it? It's right here. Look. I got three little twigs from outside. So we're just gonna do one and two and three. I think I'm all done with the face. How about you put in the arms? Me? Mm -hmm. <gasps> oh, I got two little arms right here. And let's put one on this side and the other one over here. Next, I'm gonna use three brown M&Ms for his buttons. One, two, and three. And we're all done with our Olaf. What do you think about our Olaf? Leave a comment below to let us know. And look, it's snowing. Olaf loves snow. Granny loves snow too. So much fun, but this is the end of today's video. If you like more science experiments, give us a big thumbs up and subscribe. Bye, friends and friends. Bye. Bye. Princess Toy Review. Hi, Prince and Princess, Princess Bam. Hi, Prince and Princesses, it's Princess Granny. Today, we're going to be doing the floating egg science experiment. All right, Granny, why don't you tell the kids what we need for this science experiment? Well, we need some spoons, we need an egg, a cup, some salt, water, and a measuring cup. Yep, that's all we need, and mm -hmm. you can find this all around your house, which makes it super easy. Yes. Okay, so this science experiment is going to teach us a little bit about density. Density? Mm hmm So we're going to start off by adding some water into our cup. And we're going to start by adding it half full. And next, we're going to add the egg. But what do you think? Is it going to sink or float? Leave a comment down below. And I think... That's mm. both pretty heavy, but I think the egg might sink. Whoa! That's correct, Granny. The egg will sink to the bottom because it's more dense than the water. You knew that was going to happen? I knew it, but we're going to change things up a little bit. Oh, how? Well, we're going to use the salt and we're going to add it into the water. So, I'm just going to start by measuring one cup of salt in my measuring cup here. Make sure you ask the pan for help if you need it. So, now I'm going to use my spoon. I'm going to add some salt into my water and then I'm going to mix until the salt dissolves. That's going to be a very salty egg. It is, but the salt is going to change the density of the water. Hmm, it looks like the egg is still at the bottom. Mm -hmm. I think I want to add some more salt. Yeah, I think we're going to need a lot more salt. Because what we're trying to do is get the egg to float. Oh, we're not going to cook it and eat it. Mm -hmm. Okay, I've got some salt in here. And now I mix it. Okay, so we've put in a half a cup of yes. salt. And so, we've been mixing, mixing, mixing. Okay, now let's see if the egg's gonna float. <gasps> Did you see that? No, wait a minute. It's Whoa, definitely it keeps coming floating. back up. Yep, that means now the water with the salt is now more dense than the egg, and that's why it's floating. That's the coolest egg ever. Mm -hmm. But what else can we do with the egg? I want it to float just halfway. Oh, if you want it to float halfway, I say... We have to take some salt out of the water. Well, that would be kind of hard because the salt is dissolved in the I water. I know. Already. So what we can do is we can add more water to our cup. And we, if we add just the right amount, it should float right in the middle. Okay, let's add the water. Be careful! <gasps> Whoa! Whoa! You see Whoa! that? Tree? Okay. I think it's right in the middle now. <gasps> awesome! You are so smart. Well, I just try to study a lot, Granny. Granny studies a lot too. Yep, I read. I study my toys. <laughs> I guess that is there is a toy academy that you. 
go to? Mm -hmm, I went there. Okay, so now if we want the egg to float back to the top, what do you say we add? Do we add the salt or do we add water? Leave a comment below to let us know what the right answer is. I know! Mm -hmm. I know! Brady knows? I know! Okay, Brady, what's the answer? We add more salt! That's correct! We put this in and we stir, 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 stir. Let's see if it was enough. <gasps> wow! No, it's almost flowing almost. to the very top. Little bit more salt and stir, 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 stir. And are you ready mm -hmm. to see? <gasps> awesome! Wow. Good job, Granny! Wow! That was a really fun science experiment to learn about density! But yep. this is already the end of today's video. Mm -hmm. And if you like more science experiments, give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe. Bye, Princess Princess! Bye!